Welcome back. In this video, we will learn how to add multiple pagination links on a single page. I have already created the necessary parent categories and regular categories for this Laravel 11 blog project. We will need to use the with pagination trait. Let's display two parent categories and three categories per page. To paginate our tables, just update these two queries. As you can see, we now have two parent categories and three categories on this page. So, we need to add simple pagination links below each table. Great, the pagination links have been added below each table. But there is an issue. When you click on the next pagination button for categories, it affects the parent categories pagination, which is not ideal. The same issue occurs with the parent categories pagination links. This affects the regular category's pagination. To solve this problem, we need to add two additional parameters to each paginate function in the parent categories and categories queries. Let's test it out. As you can see, only the parent categories pages change without affecting the regular categories pagination. The same goes for the categories pagination. You can navigate to any page of the categories without affecting the parent categories pagination.
Before ending this video, let's fix another issue. When deleting a parent category, we need to reassign its child categories. For example, if we delete this embedded system's parent category, the child category will become independent. In the next video, we will learn how to apply an active class to the current sidebar menu.